just uh, really happy for our team. Toledo's a really good basketball team. Uh, they're going to have a go on and have a great year. Uh, I thought Paris started us off really well, hot in that first quarter, hitting those shots, and then you know the defensive intensity for us really um, was key in that in that first half. Um, you know we played a lot of zone against them last year, and I think um, you know us playing them man uh, might have surprised them a little bit, but. I just think our team is defensively really taking pride in that, and so it's fun to watch. They made a couple of runs in. You wasn't allowed your team to, to push back and keep the lead. What was the question? It was wasn't allowed your guys to, to keep oh. the lead, push back. When, when um, the well, I thought in the third quarter, Blanca kind of took over there yeah. uh, at the end of the third. So that was that. <laughs> <laughs> and then. Um, you know, I mean, I just think we need to learn. You know, we didn't finish the game great. Uh, you know, mm -hmm. we were up 25, I think, at one point and ended up winning by 14. So we'd like to extend it, not get it trimmed down. But um, I just think there, our team is is um, really focused on what we want to accomplish every day. You know, and I think for us, you know, Tanisha didn't have a great offensive game tonight. She was frustrated at times. But for us to still beat a good team like Toledo without her – you know, going on all cylinders. I think that speaks volumes of our team. So. Do you think the third quarter struggles too happened because Doyle was on the bench with foul trouble? No, I, no, I, th I think Maddie did a good job in there. I mean, obviously losing Door, I mean, Door's very good. So when you lose her, you know, that's that changes the game a little bit. But I thought Maddie did a really good job in there um, when she was in there. Blanca, they were they were they got uh, they were on the ten to uh, to make it fifty thirty eight in the third quarter. That you scored the next nine. To put it, put it away. Did you, did you sense at that moment that you had to take over and because the momentum had switched to them? I mean, I knew we didn't score in a long time, and Coach Amy called the play for me, so I knew <coughs> I had to score somehow, you know. And like, because we run our offense every day and we work in small things every day, I knew it was going to be easier for me if I follow what they say, so I just did that. Is that okay, Amy? <laughs> Yeah, it's fine. <laughs> <laughs> do you take do you take normally? What is just you in the flow? Belt I mean, I don't usually. I'm not usually that far away, but I knew she was like sagging off me, and I don't know. I just take took it. Do, do, what did you see out there? You know, offense. You're in the offense. Well, you guys, uh, you know, really got a lot of open threes. Uh, well, what were you able to do against Toledo that enabled you guys to have the open threes? I think it's like the small things that we talked about before the game, hard cuts, um, just like be like really intense and aggressive. And I feel like because we play like with patience and we didn't force anything, we, we got a, li a lot of good shots in the game. Well, you open the game with a back row cut to her, right? Yeah. Which is something you just, was that a set play to come out? Yeah, I mean, we, we you know, we knew they were a very aggressive defense, mm -hmm. defensively, and so. We had talked a lot this week about back cuts. Back cuts. <laughs> so well, that actually wasn't the play, no. but <laughs> it still worked. <laughs> so, yeah. That's always in there, which is good. You know, a lot of times in past teams or in general, you can run a play and, and players just look for the end result of that play. And these kids do a good job of just seeing what's open through it, you know, because there are a lot of opportunities throughout that. So, Parisa, the coach talked a lot about you guys protecting your home court. How, how, how important is it for you guys to win here uh, on this court? Yeah, it's huge. I mean, our non-conference schedule, we're on the road a lot. Um, we love playing at home. We thrive playing at home. So a few games that we do have this non-conference schedule, it's huge that we win. And uh, so yeah, it's nice to be 1-0 oh at home so far. What's well, really like to be a girl in high school? Over a little three, bit. Three, three, three threes, you know, that really you know, that gave you that gave you the lead. Yeah. And you know, they had to chase the game the rest of the way. They never, you know, they never, never got within three, closer than three. What was, what was the thought? You know, you just came back off the ankle mm -hmm. midweek. Uh, you know, did you get into a flow right away? And yeah, I mean, it felt good. Um, obviously, when you hit your first shot, it always makes things a lot easier. Um, then everyone else just found me, and if I'm open, I'm going to put it up. And uh, yeah, I'm happy that it went in today. Any more questions? Uh, yeah, I, uh, can you just talk about Dor? Uh, what, what she <laughs> means uh, on the floor? Yeah, I mean, Dor, Dor's our floor general. She's super talented. Um, she finds the open man, and as you saw tonight, if they leave her open, she'll she'll make some shots too. So, yeah, Dor's, Dor's great for us. Well, can you just give us a, a summation? What, what, how did you feel the team played 
overall. And, uh, you know, again, you guys got a lot of uh, – the coach, their coach was talking about how you guys extended your possessions by getting some just offensive rebounds and, and you know, made them defend for another, you know, uh, several more seconds. How, how did the team – how did you feel the team played in, in the first game? I mean, I think we really – We've been working really hard this week, you know, a lot of energy, communication was key the whole week, key in this game too. So overall, everyone did a really good job. We started the game really good, but all the kids that came off the bench, they really did a good job. They didn't have any turnovers, that's huge for us, you know. So you can see that everyone's stepping up, we need everyone in this team. So as long as we keep working hard day by day, little things, keep the energy, the focus that we have, we will be in a good position. Mm -hmm. Bill, for you, this is your, your second year here. You guys have been here a little longer. Do you feel a little more comfortable uh, both on the court and off the court? Yeah, of course. Mm -hmm. I mean, I feel like freshman year is like a different year than the others because it's like it takes time to like get used like to everything and like just like get into like the rhythm of everything. I um, mean, this year, like I knew like I know what uh, what is coming for. So I feel like much more ready and that's it. Yes. Were you a little frustrated that you had to go to the bench with, with the four fouls? Um, a little bit, but it was the right call. I had like four <laughs> fouls, so. Thank I mean, job. no, because I like to play, of course, but yeah. And the team uh, did a really good job in like uh, keep the lead and even like extend it, so it was good. They, they push you guys in practice, the, the kids off the bench every day to, to keep you guys sharp? Yeah, I mean, yeah. they work really hard. They get better, but they make us be better every day, you know. Mm -hmm. So small things, they is what they I don't know makes our team special. Yeah, we talked to Freeze just about you know, coach had said told me or, you know that you guys uh, wanted you to, to attack the basketball, and that was evident tonight. You guys really did when the three wasn't there mm -hmm. you know, to the hole. Yeah, exactly. We don't always just want to rely on us having a good shooting night, so uh, it's important for us to establish an inside game too. And yeah, I think Bonnie did a good job inside mm -hmm. and you know, getting inside to Tanisha, so it's going to be important for us moving forward. Well, Bonnie hit some big drives for you there. Yeah, Bonnie played a great game. Mm -hmm. yeah. The other thing, too, for any of you, you just always had the answer. Whenever they would make a run, you, you, it would be either a couple threes or, in your case, nine straight points. You guys just seem to be able to answer their runs and, and keep them at a distance so they couldn't get any further momentum. Nor? I feel like... We recognize like those moments that we have like a, like a negative momentum. I, can I say that? Yeah. <laughs> so we know like okay, we need like to to do something good now and like to bring the momentum to our side. So every time like it's it can be like a different things, but like Blanca took the lead one time. One time I think we did like a really good job like defensively and it's just like to recognize it and then like uh, go and get it. <laughs> I guess. So I mean. You know, this is obviously an impressive, you know, 27 points lead with six minutes left in the, and, you, and you said you'd like to finish a little better, but is that the one thing you take from this game, or do you take, uh, what do you take from this game? Yeah, I mean, I just, I, I think it's a really solid win for our team, you know, in our program. We, we talked a lot at the end of last year about winning the games that, you know, we need to win, and Toledo was one of them. You know, uh, we lost that game last year, um, and so and, and they're really they have three seniors who played a lot of basketball. It's a really good team. Uh, so I think in general, just coming out and, and playing a team like that and, and getting playing well together um, is really big for us. Um, yeah, we, we like to finish off better for sure, um, but it's I love this team because the things that we talk about every day, the things that we work on every day in practice, you can see them doing it in a game, and then. When they do it, they see success, and, and it's just it's fun. You know what I mean? Like they they really listen, and they're so coachable, and and everything we talked about, they do. You know, um, and sometimes we do we tell them to do things that are crazy, and <laughs> it doesn't work, and so we change it. <laughs> but um, they're just a great team, and so they're they're really fun to be around, and um, a lot of fun to coach. So. Uh, boys hurt you last year. She only hit five, and it only it, it didn't get her first basket till the third quarter. Is there anything? You, you, was that obviously it was something you emphasized. What, yeah. How did you defend her? Well, Blanca had her for most of the game, um, and as we all know, Blanca's the best defender in the conference, so that helps. Sure. Um, <laughs> but Maddie guarded her as well, um, and so our big thing with her is getting back in transition. You know, mm -hmm. she loves to get the ball and go, and so I thought our whole team did a really good job getting back in transition today. 
Um, and, and, you know, it, when Blanca guards, guards you, it's really tough. Ask anyone in practice. It's, it's hard. Sam McIntyre had 24 for them, but, you know, and you, they decided quickly that they were just going to pound it in. Yeah. Them. Yeah, they did. And, you know, the first half we were fronting her, and she got a ton of easy layups, mm -hmm. you know. And so second half we were playing behind. She got some. When we started to double her, she struggled. Mm -hmm. So, again, it's, it's kind of changing up how we guard. We need to do it a little quicker, the coaches do, um, to help out the players in those situations. What, what did you do on Void Block? Did you just try to, just, you know, try to force her to a weak side? or? I mean – I knew what she likes to do, like she likes pull up game, and if she ri like drives to the right, she's gonna try to get to the basket. So I was just trying to keep her away from doing that. And then they run a lot of screens, so our post like they really do a good job. So we stick with our plan, and obviously it worked. Last question. Thank you. Great, thank, you. Thank, you. thank you. Thank you guys. Thank you very much. Get some rest, guys. Yeah. <laughs>